I've got a feeling, a feeling deep inside. Oh yeah. Hey everybody, Ben here. Feel the music. Um, this is another episode in my uh, series of uh, going through my album collection, ten poles at a time. And out of that ten, I'm going to select my favorite. And when we all get to the end, I'll go back to the first 10 polls, and most favorites will go up against other favorites. And we'll see if I can figure out who my what my favorite albums are that I have. Yeah, who knows? This was a hard one, too. But anyway, I don't want these videos to get long. I know people have better things to do probably than to watch my goofy videos. But if you like what you see, please subscribe and make a comment. And... Uh, so let's just get on with it. The first one, 1963, My Boyfriend's Back by the Angels. Of course, this was a, an all-girl pop group from back in 63. And uh, you know, my boyfriend's back and you're going to be in trouble. Yeah, you know the song. So anyway, so the rest of them, it's all one band the next nine so can you guess where my favorites gonna come from probably yeah I don't think it's that one anyway first up um, April wine on record yeah it, it's on record because it's it's a record right yeah 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 same as the front same as the back kind of clever actually and then the inside shows the guys, all that and all that. So this is, uh, <clears throat> but if you look real, real close, you can see pictures. I know it's probably not going to show up, but you can see their faces inside there. So yeah, that's, that's pretty cool, I think. Hmm? Next up is April Wine Stand Back. Uh, 1975 um, and I, I didn't really get into April wine until much later and we'll talk about that in a sec up next is April wines the whole world's going crazy hey that would fit today wouldn't it uh-huh Once again, I don't, I can't find the the year this one came out, but it probably came out in 2024, don't you think? Yep. Anyway, uh, "Gimme Love" is on here. I like that. Uh, Rock and Roll, Roll Woman, um, like a lover, like a song, good stuff. Next is uh, "April Wine," recorded live. At the El Macambo. Um, but there's something about uh, interesting about this for those of you who may not know. Um, this was the first time that the Rolling Stones had made a club appearance since the mid 60s. And uh, and for the El Mocombo, or however you pronounce that, um, it was two nights of complete glory, right? I had the Stones playing there. And it was uh, that same atmosphere that April Wine was actually asked to share the stage that week in March. Um, so... Yeah, by chance, I don't know, but anyway, you can tell on here there's some rough stuff, so whether they weren't prepared for it or whatever, I, I don't know. Anyway, ramble, ramble. And some more April wine, yep. Okay, so here's the story. I'm not going to belabor it much, I promise. Remember in my last episode, Angel was a blind pole? This April Wine album was a blind pull. 
first glance. And I know there's other versions of this, um, but this is the one I got. Um, so I actually um, also had this on 8-track, and I wore that 8-track out. Of course, it didn't take much to wear 8-tracks out, right? All you had to do was have a little matchbook and stuff so you could put it in there so it stopped dragging and all that fun stuff. But yeah, this was, uh, I first heard this and, mm -hmm. get ready for love, hot on the wheels of love, rock and roll is a vicious game. One of my favorite songs. Right down to it, roller, coming right down on top of me, I'm alive, let yourself go, and uh, silver dollar. So, yep, first glance. And when I thought first glance, I thought, well, it must be their first album. Well, as you can tell, they had a lot of albums before that. And then we move on to Harder, Faster, another killer album by April Wine. Um, this one has the, the super big hit, I Like to Rock. Yeah, probably my all-time favorite uh, April Wine song. Notice I didn't say album. I said favorite. Although this is... A very good album to do a cover of 21st Century Schizoid Man. Um, yeah, cool stuff on this one. Just a couple more to go. Also like this album, Power Play. Um, I, I don't know what really to say. Um, anything you want, I got it. Um, if you see K, no, I didn't say what you think I said. Nope. I said, if you see K, tell her I miss her or love her. Yeah. Doing it right. Ain't got your love. Yeah. Um, but anyway, yep, they do a Beatles cover here of Tell Me Why. Very good. So, yep, four up one. Two more. This is when they got to the point where, you know, I could kind of take or leave them. Um, April Wine, Animal Grace. Um, I think they released, this could be the right one, Sons of the Pioneer. Rock Tonight was pretty good. Hard Rock Kid was pretty good. Um, but uh, anyway, yeah, April Wine. And last but not least... This is the last April Wine album I have, and this is Walking Through Fire. Um, got the song Rock Myself to Sleep was the hit that came off of here. Um, uh, da, 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 da. In Wanted Dead or Alive is pretty good. So, but yeah, anyway. So, that's... Uh, that's 10 more polls, and it shouldn't be any surprise when I tell you or show you that my favorite one for this 10 is April Wine First Glance. Yep, my first introduction to April Wine, so my favorite album out of these 10 by April Wine. Although, I will tell you that Harder Faster came in really close second so anyway this has been and remember music is not always to hear but music is to feel see you next time bye